Cooper! What's up, buddy? Welcome back to another episode of Super Cooper Sunday. As you guys can see, we finally got our new Swagway back in the mail, and uh, hopefully we don't break this thing doing 180s. But anyway, today is Super Cooper Sunday, and guess what, Coop? We have a new Bark Box that we're gonna have to open. Are you excited for this, buddy? So I'm gonna go get you guys set up on the uh, on the tripod. We're gonna get in bed. We're gonna snuggle up, and we are gonna open up these boxes. Are you excited, Coop? Or are you just scared of the Segway? <laughs> I think he's just scared of this thing. So uh, anyway, it's gonna be good, and I'll see you guys in a sec. There he is. What's going on, guys? We are back for another Super Cooper Sunday, and guess what, Coop? You got two bark boxes this month. You got two of them. Are you excited? Are you just so excited right now? He may be a little bit tired. Uh, today, they actually, him and Coda, uh, Coda was over earlier this morning and they were playing like crazy. So he has been doing his like little, you guys see how he kind of looks like an alligator here? He always does it. He like sits his chin down like he's an alligator in the water or something like that. But Coop, we gotta open up your presents. We gotta open up your presents, buddy. You excited? You got two of them. All right, come here. Get over here. You gotta get up here. You gotta check it out. Look at this. All right, so this is the first one. I think this is the normal bark box and then. This says extra goodies. I'm not sure why we got extra goodies, but ooh, look at him. He's already checking it out. He's excited about this. Okay, so looks like we have a little card type thing here. Are you kidding? I only came along because I thought it was made of cheese. <laughs> it's a dog on the moon. That's, uh, that's kind of funny. But um, yeah, so it looks like this is, oh, it's a, a list of everything that's in the box. So there's a flying saucer, a play star, a diner pizza, pasty crust, an emerald pet piggy twizzy, and a Space Rover bandana. Oh, Coop, you've been wearing bandanas. So you'll be able to get another bandana. So it uh, looks like we got a star here. This kind of looks like the Mario, like, Invincibility Star, which is kind of cool. Look at that, Coop. Is that a new toy for you? Oh, he likes that one. <laughs> He's licking it. You're supposed to play with it. Play tug of war with me. Um, here we, it looks like we have a flying saucer. So it looks like you're going out of this world with this, this theme box, Coop. Ooh, this one, it's actually, it's super tough. Like, it, there's like a plastic thing on the inside. And it squeaks. I think he's afraid of that. <laughs> What's so funny? You like that? I'm about to take all these tabs off before you choke on them, but you like that? Okay, so that one's that. Looks like we have a bandana here. Space Rover. What else does it say on it? Uh, Intrepid Interplanetary Dog Explorer. All right, so we are gonna put this on the coop. Oh, wow, this one's huge. This is way too big for him. Oh my goodness. All right, so we are going to put that on you. It's more of a cape than a bandana, bud, but uh, I think that's going to be okay. We're actually, it looks like we may be running out of battery, so we're going to have to hurry this up. All right, so uh, it looks like we also have some Piggy Twizzies, which is an all-natural dog chew. That's going to be nice for you to chew on. You've been getting tons of treats recently. You are a spoiled pup. And then we also have uh, Just the Crust Pizza Potty. Uh, treats here, so we're gonna see. We'll, we'll open these up. This one's gonna be easy to open. The other one, we're gonna need some scissors. So we're gonna open this up here. You ready for a pizza party? Here we go. Let's see if he if he likes that. You gonna eat it? You're supposed to eat it. <laughs> He's always super particular about his food and his treats. Like sometimes he'll go up to his food and he'll take like a little mouthful and take it somewhere else and eat it individually. And then his treats he'll always save for later. I'm not sure. These may not be his favorite. A wheat corn, wheat corn and soy free. To me they're a little bit too healthy, huh? We like that, that good stuff, right? All right, cool. So anyway, let's move on to box number two. This is the extra goodies. I'm not sure why he's getting extra goodies because he's been on quite a terrible tear before. Uh, recently, not before. Uh, I'll have to tell you guys about some of what's happened. So it looks like, oh, this is some of the same stuff here, except, oh, nice. Look at this. So this is an even bigger saucer, which is pretty sweet. Look at that poop. You just like that? He likes that. These are some of the bigger toys, it looks like. So maybe these are meant for, for bigger dogs. Maybe there's like a smaller dog box and a bigger dog box. He's starting to get a little bit bigger. So that's probably where I got these. What is this? A Tizzy Zogo Flex. This, uh, it's like a tennis ball with legs or something like that. This is a really weird thing. Cooper, gonna have to play with that later. Looks like we also have this here. There's kind of like a, a little alien here, Loopy's Alien. So this thing's pretty tough. It's made kind of out of like a nylon mesh type material. So he's gonna be able to play with that. Oh, it's got a squeaky in it too. Those are his favorite. You guys can see. He really likes the squeaky. So fall around everywhere. Uh, then we also have another 
Space Rover, so maybe we could gift this to uh, Dakota, Dakota Bear. And then we also have uh, Yummy Crunchy Duck Plus Sweet Potato Chew Bar, which that sounds pretty good, Coop, doesn't it? And we have finally, oh man, this looks like something I might like, Lamb Lung Chips. But this kind of looks like a dog version of beef jerky, so we're going to see... This, it's, it kind of smells like pretty strong, so I think, I think he's really gonna like this. Oh man, oh, this is, uh, it doesn't really smell good, <coughs> but it smells. It definitely smells. I think he's a, uh, a fan of that, guys. But uh, yes, there you guys have it. That is our Bark Box unboxing there. It's been a while since we did one of these things. I think we actually skipped last month. I, I get a lot of boxes and I, I'll have to look for it in my office somewhere. We may be doing another one of these here pretty soon. But uh, that's what we got for, for this month, Coop. You got one, two, three, four, many other toys, five, five new toys and a bunch of treats. Aren't you lucky? As if I don't already get you enough of those things. Anyway, let me tell you guys what happened last night. So uh, yesterday I went down to um, Venice, Florida. Look at Coop. Look how happy he is right now in his bed full of toys and treats. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. Oh, man. Anyway, I went down to Venice and I was there for probably like six to eight hours, which, I mean, I don't like leaving Coop alone like that, but I mean, six to eight hours isn't that big of a deal. He can handle that. That's just like a normal work day. Like a lot of people go off to work and they come back home later. But anyway, so... Some of you guys might remember from setup videos and stuff, I used to have these really cool sticks in here. They're like, you know, decorative sticks, and then they also had like lights wrapped around them and stuff. When you plugged them in, they looked really good. As well as I had a cable for, uh, for my cable TV. And he took it upon himself. You guys can see some of the sticks. I guess I didn't get quite all of them. He took it upon himself. I came home. This was knocked over in the center of the floor here. And he had broken up all the sticks that were long. Like, the sticks were long. That's what she said. But the sticks were, like, you know, probably two to three feet long. I'm trying to focus on this here. They were probably two to feet, three feet long. And he broke them up into little, like, two-inch, one-inch and two-inch sections. And they were littered everywhere. They were under the couch. They were under the table. They were all around here. It was absolutely nuts. Everywhere. And, uh, you know, like he chewed through the cord and two, and I came in and he was just sitting there just wagging his tail. And I was like, you son of a gun. He's kind of starting to get into that phase where he wants to get into everything. He wants to chew on everything. He wants to pull things out of the trash. He wants to, you know, pull dirty laundry out and leave it all over the floor and stuff like that. Like he's, he's getting very explorative, I guess. And I think this is kind of a phase they go through that should last for a few months. But, um... Yeah, so he was so happy about himself, and I was like, Cooper, what's going on? I was trying to ask him about it and, you know, kind of show him that, you know, what he did was wrong and stuff. I wasn't yelling at him or trying to hit him or anything like that. And uh, he got really scared because he knew that I, like, wasn't happy with him. And so he peed. So, like, in the midst of all this, now I had pee-soaked wood chips, and it was just, it was really bad. I was really sad to come home to that, but, uh, I mean, I love him anyway. You can't, you can't hate the guy. He's such a good boy. So, uh, yeah, there you guys have it. Just kind of a, a quick little Super Cooper Sunday here. I wanted to go ahead and do the Bark Box because I've seen some comments about it recently. You guys have been asked about it, where it went, stuff like that. So, uh, there you guys have it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys next week, and we probably are actually finally going to do, like, the fist bump and stuff. We're going to teach them how to do that and hopefully get in some more advanced tricks uh, in the coming weeks as well. As uh, I think you guys really liked last week's episode. You guys, I've seen a lot of comments saying, like, I really liked how it was like a day in the life with Cooper type of deal. So hopefully we'll start to do a little bit more of that where it's not just like one little sequence, but it's kind of like throughout the day or throughout, you know, maybe a couple of days or throughout the week even of little clips and stuff that I could put together and hopefully make the episodes a little bit, um, you know, longer and more entertaining for you guys. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it half as much as Coop is enjoying his lamb chops, then I think that's pretty good. Oh, stretch. Oh, man. All right. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you guys later. Peace out.